Hi, um, Principal Asman. Hello. I'm Principal Asman's secretary. She's out of office at the moment. So you're like not Principal Asman? No. Even though you look like, sound like, and have the same like tattoo as Principal Asman. Who's asking? Um, like Emma Whitlock, a distressed student. Unless you have my, I mean, Principal Asman's DoorDash delivery. She can't come to the phone right now. Oh, what? It's her lunch break. Okay, well, you're, uh, I mean, her mother, <sighs> Mrs. Asman, like, sent me down here to, like, speak with her. <sighs> She's very busy right now, but I'll see what I can do. Do you need principal, counselor, or daughter Asman? Counselor. Oh, that sounds mentally taxing right now. Are you, like, joking? Yeah, I don't think she can make that work today, but feel free to leave a message and she'll get back to you in five to seven business days but probably closer to seven. Oh my God, please. I like literally have nobody else to talk to. I just like found out that I'm pregnant in front of like the entire class. But if I already know you're inexperienced, my expectations are not gonna be high. This is super confidence boosting. Why don't you go home and do some research? We search? Research. We search? Research. Oh, that kind of research. Um, hmm. I've never watched research before. Never? I've watched a lot of research. I've researched research. I've done research. I've made my own research. I have even shared my research with multiple others at the same time. Okay, that's a lot of things. I think the very least I can do is watch the research. I believe in you. Wait, what, what genre of research? Um, please just start with something basic. You're gonna get scared. Basic research. Okay. And then I'll be ready? Probably not. Okay, I'm giving myself a deadline. Okay, I'm giving myself a deadline. What are you doing on May 18th? I guess you. Okay. That's it. My flower is getting deflowered on May 18th. Please never say that again. My flower is getting deflowered on May 18th! Gerald? What are you doing? I had to go to the bathroom. What is happening to your flower on May 18th? Um, deflowering? Yeah, I did hear that right. You probably shouldn't be having sex before marriage or with a girl. That's lesbianism. Yeah, I'm a lesbian. That's disgusting. Well, so are your constant sinus infections. You're just jealous that girls like JJ and not you. Yeah. Why are you not leaving? I want to watch you guys make out. You're not seeing us kiss. I already did earlier. I've been down here for 20 minutes. I like literally have nobody else to talk to. I just like found out that I'm pregnant in front of like the entire class. Oh, okay. That's some tea. I, I think her schedule actually just cleared up. Are you like serious? Hi. I hear you have some hot goss. Counselor Asman is here to listen. Have a seat. This is like so weird. So, spill. Well, I was like in class waiting for a call from like my doctor about my pregnancy results and your stupid mother, no offense, like took my phone and answered it in front of the entire freaking class. And now I'm pretty sure like everybody knows I'm pregnant. Hmm. So you just found out you're pregnant. Yeah, that's what I just said. And is this your second, third? What? Fourth? Fourth what? Child. No, I don't have children. I'm like 16. Oh, right. We are in high school. Well, it's uncommon, but not impossible. So this is your first pregnancy then, I presume? Yes. Right, right. And, um... How far along are you? I don't know. I didn't even get to speak to my doctor because your, like, mother answered it for me. Girl, calm down. There's no reason to get snappy with me. I am just trying to help. I know it's not your fault. The pregnancy hormones are probably making you feel crazy. Uh, sorry. So, who's the father? Um. You don't know, do you? No. Okay, well, like, how many people have you been with in the last couple months? Well, I, like, can't get pregnant from girls. So, in terms of guys... I think like 23. 
Huh. Okay. Well, that's not going to help us. Um, we're going to need to figure out a better timeline of, like, around when you conceived. Okay, well, like, only my doctor would know. And, like, probably Mrs. Asman. We're going to need to figure out a better timeline of, like, around when you conceived. Okay, well, like, only my doctor would know. And, like, probably Mrs. Asman. I got you. Are you, like, calling Mrs. Asman? Hi, yes, um, this is Emma Whitlock's mother. Um, I was wondering if we could speak with someone who could go over her pregnancy results with us. Uh, yes, she's right here. Tell them you consent to me being here. Hi, yes, I consent. Perfect, thank you. They're gonna find a nurse to talk with us. What's up, Prince? My teacher sent me down again. Birdie, you can't keep causing problems to get sent down here just to flirt with me. But go clean the second floor toilets as punishment for whatever you did to your teacher. Yes, ma'am. Oh, hey, Emma. What are you doing here? Um, I'm having some, like, anxiety. Yo, that's not fun. Go! He's... He's one of the, um, like, potential fathers. That doesn't surprise me. He's a feral little thing. Yeah. Hi, yes, I'm here. Um, I was wondering if you could give us a better idea of the date of conception. We're trying to figure out who the father is. Uh, doesn't know who the father she's is. She's only 15 mm -hmm. and she doesn't know who the father is. Yeah, she doesn't know. I, yeah, are you sure you have the right girl? No, she has absolutely no clue. Uh, should, should we talk to her about who it could be? I mean, well, it could be up to like 23 different people, so we're trying to narrow it down. Less than chlamydia, risk of uh, HIV. Okay. She goes and you will come in for an STD test immediately. She does a very well. Yeah, I can send her in for an STD test. Well, when um, do eight weeks, so I'll do the February 4th. Blah, okay. Blah, 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 okay. All right. Okay, Thank blah, you. Blah, blah. All right. Bye. Okay, so they, like, want you to go get an STD test. Um, but they did say you're about, like, eight weeks pregnant. So they said, like, the week of, like, February 4th. So, um, like, which one of your guys did you sleep with that week? Um, I don't know. Okay, that would, like, narrow it down from 23 to, like, 7. All right. Okay, that would, like, narrow it down from 23 to, like, 7. All right. One per day. That's... You're getting it. Um, no, <laughs> I was actually like sick like half that week. So it was actually like all crammed into like three days. Yeah. You know what? I I'm not here to judge. I got pregnant five times in high school. Oh, wow. Where like are they all now? Probably in a vacuum somewhere. I don't know how that works. Oh, so are you going to want to abort it? Um, I like don't know. I like just found out I was pregnant like... 10 minutes ago and I don't like even know who the father is and I like clearly haven't thought far ahead right the father the father I mean I guess I like don't really need to know unless I like want to keep it Luke I am your father that was kind of bad are you gonna tell your mom um no she'd like kill me Okay, girl, like, speaking from personal experience, this is not going to be easy for you. You're going to have no support system at home, and at school, you're going to be outcasted for being the pregnant high schooler. So, you're saying you'll, like, be there for me? Uh, I mean, I, I can a little. I don't work off the clock. I barely work on the clock. You can hang out in here, though. Aren't you, like, at least going to, like, fire Mrs. Asman for, like, HIPAA violation of, like, a student? Yeah, I'm actually, like, not allowed to fire her because she's my mother. I've tried, like, 20 times, but the entire family gangs up on me because the last time she got fired, she went off the rails and kept waking up in places she didn't recognize and then joined the cartel in Mexico and... Mm, what? Yeah, she's here for good. I, I can't fire her. Okay. So, like, who are you now? Oh, I'm the secretary. Principal Asman had to step out for lunch. But she informed me that you're welcome to stay here for the rest of the day. All right, I'm just, like, gonna go in that corner and, like, have a mental breakdown. Have fun. Okay, I made it out. I had to tell Mrs. Mabubi that I was about to sh my pants, so she'd let me leave. Okay, I'm out, too. I told my teacher I just got my period, and he's a man, so anytime you mention anything about the female anatomy, they just get really uncomfortable. I'm pretty sure straight men don't even actually like women. So true. Meet at our usual makeout spot? Duh. <gasps> Baby! I missed you. Oh my god, I know. It's been a whole 18 minutes. You come here now. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, I guess we're going down. Uh-oh. 
Whoa. Yeah? I'm feeling something. Oh, your stomach really does hurt? No, a little lower. It hurts? No. Oh, me too. I get that feeling a lot. Like, every five minutes. I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. I do. No, this isn't the white setting. What do you mean? What in school? There's no privacy. And there's way too many lights. And there's no candles or rose petals. Um, I'm sure there's a light switch around here somewhere. Candles? Oh, I'm pretty sure Principal Aspen has one on her desk. I can go ask her to borrow it. Rose petals? Um, oh, there might be some in the dumpster left over from Valentine's Day. This is not romantic. Yeah, you're right. It'd still be a lot nicer than my first time, though. That's really sad, Zoe. Eh, I gave into temptation. Well, I'd say I'm like this close to. I like those odds. But I think I value myself a little more than this. Are you saying I don't value myself? Um, I didn't really mean to say that, but I guess that's what I didn't buy. Yes. That's so mean to say to your girlfriend. I mean, we both know it's true. Uh, I'm leaving. I'm leaving. What? No. I, that was really wrong of me to say. I, I'm really sorry. What? I'm completely in the wrong. Please forgive me. You're taking accountability for your actions and not blaming it on me? Nobody's ever done that before. Yeah, I'm not toxic. I can admit when I'm wrong. I've never been this attracted to someone in my life. The bare minimum is sexy. Kiss me. I need your lips. That was easy. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I love this. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh my god. Zoe? Yeah, say my name. Zoe. Again? No, I'm trying to talk to you. Oh. Um... I do want to do it. Yay! I knew you'd get over the musty stairwell. No, I still don't want to do it in the musty stairwell. Oh. But we should do it. Soon. Tonight? Too soon. This evening? That is sooner than tonight. Okay. We should do it. Soon. Tonight? Too soon. This evening? That is sooner than tonight. Okay. Okay, I'm not good at planning, so why don't you tell me? Okay. Um, let me look at my Google Calendar. Okay. Okay, Monday, I have school. Tuesday, I have school. Wednesday, I have school. Um, Thursday, I have school. Friday, you have school. No, it's a holiday. Oh, perfect. What about then? I have plans with my family for the holiday. Saturday? Saturday, I watch TV with my dad. What? After? It's usually an all-day thing. Sunday? Homework. JJ, if you don't want to, it's okay. No, I do want to. I'm just... I'm nervous. Well, I have a lot of experience, so you don't have to be nervous. That makes me more nervous. I'm gonna look like a chump. But if I already know you're inexperienced, my expectations are not gonna be high. Hey, Dad, can you help me with my homework? What is going on in here? It looks like a game show to see who's going to be my new stepmother. Oh, no, it's not that serious. This is all casual. Me and your mother aren't divorced yet. There's still hope. Looks really hopeful. Bobby, aren't you going to introduce us to your daughter? Why? You're not going to be around that long. Aw, she's cute. She reminds me of my son. Is that supposed to be a compliment? Oh, yeah, yeah, Karen has a daughter your age. Maybe you know her. I'm Susan. That's Karen. I'm Karen, but I don't have any kids yet. No. Who the hell had a daughter then? Christine? I'm Sharon. I have a son, but he's pretty feminine looking. Oh god, it's so hard to keep you ladies straight. Dad, how did you even find all these women? I found this new dating app called eDate. It's the best one I've tried. I mean, clearly it's going well. And it's way more fun than the ones you have to swipe, because instead of swiping, you spin it like a slot machine, and it shows you six different ladies. And you can win free messaging, free boosts, send icebreakers and see who likes you back. Oh, and I just won three extra spins. And you can look at their profile, and then lock in the ones you're interested in, and then you end up here. I'm gonna go now. What is that? Absolutely not. Where is it? I love having silky soft smooth skin so I got the at home you like laser hair removal device but I guess I missed this one. Hey are, are you Zoe? Is that my new Air 10? Ma'am I don't know I just deliver them. Here. Yes. No no stay. Ma'am I need to get back to work. I said stay. Sit. I need to share this moment with someone even if it's just you. How am I supposed to get in there?
What's the difference? The Air Tan has two lamps instead of one, which increases the treatment area, so now you can get more done in a shorter amount of time. With four flashes per second, it can achieve four times the intensity of powerful laser hair removal. Mm -hmm. And now with the Sapphire Ice Cooling, it's even cooler than the Air 3, so you won't experience any pain. It just feels like a nice size Coke. I, I love this. And the Air 10 is the first model to feature a skin sensor. Thanks for making me stay. So, instead of having to guess your skin settings, the Air 10 will automatically detect your skin tone and auto-adjust the treatment power and even stop flashing when it needs to. So good. So good. And the Air 10 has four power modes. It has fast mode for maintenance and small touch-ups, normal mode for normal hair, high mode for coarse, thick hair, and SHR mode for stubborn hair. It can also be used to remove hair in sensitive areas, such as VIO hair removal. Do you think I could have your old one if you don't need it anymore? For your wife? No, for me. I I'm not married. But maybe if my back was less hairy, women would like me. That's your back hair? I thought you were wearing a sweater. I get that a lot. Here. And if you do find a wife, tell her to use my code Michaela off for $100 off her own laser hair removal device. And you guys can use my code too. Where am I? Why does my head hurt? Who are you? JJ. I'm... I'm your best friend. Oh. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. You're so pretty. Mm, really? She is, yeah. She is. <sighs> Come on, JJ. Let's go to my room and play. Okay. Okay, you kids have fun. Pain I just... I honestly don't remember anything. Okay, well, just ask me whatever you want to know and I can just remind you. Okay, um, how long have we been best friends? Mm, well, a really long time, but you actually just admitted to me yesterday that you have feelings for me. I think you're a lesbian. Huh. Well, I guess that makes sense. Yeah, you told me you wanted to kiss me, actually. I did? Yeah. You're very pretty. Yeah. JJ, it's time to go home. That's what? How does it feel, bitch? Mommy! Kill me. Mommy. What do you want now? JJ called me flat-chested. Well, you are, honey. But don't worry, you'll get some boobs when you go through puberty. Maybe. And if not, you can just get a boob job like me. Tell her to go home. Nobody likes her. I like her. She's been making fun of me all night. Has she? Yeah, because you're a loser and you're embarrassing to be even seen with. No. You think you're cute because you carry that little horsey around? You're such a weirdo. No wonder no one's ever kissed you. <laughs> I got plenty of hoes, bitch. Did me a favor, hon. No, I'm gonna go to jail for the rest of my life. Don't worry, hon. We'll take care of it. Ricardo, it happened again. We're gonna need the shovel. Thanks, mom. So, hon, how's school going? What did I do? What did I do? Ah, shit. What happened? I'm dead. Oh, sorry. Oh, it's okay. Wait, you're Emma Whitlock, right? Yeah. Oh my god. I've heard, like, so much about you. Like, good or bad? Honestly, it's mixed. That's fair. So, like, what are you listening to? What? Like, like your earpiece. Oh, um, it's Rihanna's new album. What? Rihanna doesn't have a new album. She doesn't even, like, release music anymore. Trust me, I would know. Yeah, but she could, like, drop something at any minute. You just, like, never know. Oh. I just, like, want to be prepared. Low-key, that's, like, so smart. I'm a diehard for Rihanna, too. Oh, my God. Did we just become, like, besties? Yeah. Okay. Next up, please put your hands together for our school's very own Woo! band, who so generously offered to play tonight. Yay! Please give it up for Yeast Infection and the STDs. Vince Gerald. I'm Nova. Nova? Why hasn't he texted me back? It's been like two minutes. This is not good. He definitely thinks I'm ugly. Nope, that's it. I'm just ugly. Or he's cheating on me. Yeah, that's that's it. He probably found someone prettier. No, I should give him some credit. Maybe he just like lost his phone or something. Maybe maybe it died. Maybe his phone died. Oh my god, his snap score went up. No, his phone definitely did not die. He just hates me. Okay, there's probably a rational explanation for this. Maybe he's with his grandma, like, fixing her Wi-Fi or something, and, you know, he could just respond to one snap really quick. That's, that's, that's it. Oh my god, it went up another 10? Are you fucking kidding me? Okay, he's not with his grandma. What a fucking asshole. I am never speaking to him ever again. This is...
This is just not okay. I'm never talking to him ever again. Ever. I don't care what the reason is. How dare he just play with my heart like that? This is not okay. I just I need a moment. Oh my god, it's him. I knew he would text me back. I wonder who that is. Oh my god, JJ, I'm here. And I bought something for everyone. Oh my god, like you got booze. No, I bought homemade cupcakes. Um, thanks. I'm sure everyone will like love these. Yo, are those weed cupcakes? No, Ugh, lame. Um, that one like fell over. Oh, weed? I thought you said tweed. <laughs> yes, they're weed. Definitely. JJ, you're the man. Yeah, you can have the ugly one. Oh my god. Mia, please, it's been five minutes. Yeah, 30 more seconds. I'm shaving my cooch. <laughs> Mom, can you tell Mia to get out of the shower? JJ, you have to wait your turn. She was in there first. It's not my fault. We're too poor to afford two bathrooms. Excuse me? She's been here for 30 minutes and I need to get ready for my date. Mia, get out of the shower or you're paying for the water bill. Fine, I'll just have a half shaven cooch. You have a date? Yes, but at this weight, I'm probably not gonna make it. What's her name? It it's a boy, actually. What? I thought you were gay, honey. Yeah, me too. All that counseling on how to raise a gay daughter was for nothing? Mia is gay. No, she has a boyfriend. Uh, no, she's just a masculine lesbian. Oh. Finally! There's no hot water left. I hate you. Like that, huh? More. What the flick? Oh, hi, cow. What is going on? Why is Mrs. Smith here? Uh, well, um. Why are you having a play date with my ex girlfriend's mom and not my mom? Sometimes grown ups like to have play dates with more than one person. Honey, sometimes the person you're playing games with just wants to play the same game over and over again. Right. And it gets kind of boring, so you want to play a new game with a new person. Something's fishy. So how's school going? No, wait a wait. It smells like tuna in here. Mm-hmm. Are you going to get a divorce? <gasps> I can see how this is a little awkward for you, hon. Why don't I take you to my plastic surgeon to make you feel better? He made me feel better. You're not taking my daughter to get a boob job. I don't want bigger boobs. Well, honey, now you just sound crazy. She's a kid. I like to look at them, but I don't want to have them. I mean, who doesn't want bigger boobs? I want someone to love me for my personality and intellect, not my boobies. Well, I don't have either of those, so... She really doesn't. But I do have a bleached asshole. What? You, you do have that, yeah. Just live, bro. I know. All the older hot girls are wearing short dresses. I'm in the atmosphere, but yeah. Dude, how are we even here? We're freshmen. Rain school ask me like a oh, regular customer of mine. Bro, that's dope. Thanks for taking me as your date. Why did you air quotes around date, bro? Because we're not actually on a date. Oh, uh, wait, dude, did you think we were like going to prom together? No, bro. Of course not. All right, good, bro, because that would have been hella awkward. Yeah. Mike, this is a formal event. No hats allowed. I can't take this off, bro. Take it off. No, man, please. No one has ever seen you without it my hat, against bro. bro. Take it off, or I will have you escort. Why do you always just stick up your ass, man? I must know, what is your attraction to me? Um, Gemini. <laughs> Not again. Can you please stay with me for a little while and comfort me? I'm too sad to be alone. <laughs> please, Woz! Um, yes, of course. <laughs> Wait, how do you know any? Um... Because I secretly have a huge crush on you. 
I know who you were all year. Oh my God, this is heavy stuff. Wait, so are you bisexual then? No, I'm a lesbian. You just said you had a boyfriend. Oh. I was twine again. I understand. I don't know, I'm a Gemini. What's in your ear? Um. What are you listening to? Just the relaxing sounds of horses neighing. It calms me. Hmm. Okay. Okay, this is ridiculous. Oh my god. Casey, Rose is heading to the bathroom to look for you. Well, I have to go meet Max. Do something. Roger. Over. What do we do? I don't know. Zoe? 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 Zoe, we need your help. Over. Zoe. 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 Yep. Zoe. She's a goner. JJ, Rose is going to the bathroom and she's going to realize that Casey's not in there. We need to do something. Quick. Do something. I'll improvise. Okay. Casey. Casey, love, are you okay? <laughs> oh my god, are you okay? <laughs> no, my boyfriend just broke up with me. He told me we were going to get married. <laughs> he bought me a party ring and made me promise we wouldn't have sex until marriage. And then I called him cheating on me with someone else. Very much having sex. Jesus, love, you have a rough night. <laughs> it is the most fun time of the night. For nobody except them. But it is time to announce the proud king and queen. Yay! Hey guys, what did I miss? They're about to announce who won the Super Bowl. What happened to your face? Magic. Damn, JJ's pulling bitches. Not bitches. Attractive young women. Whatever, dude, don't make it. Okay, and the proud queen is. Tasty Smith. What? How's that possible? She's a freshman. I genuinely don't know, but I um, it. she got the most votes by an overwhelming amount. <laughs> Shit. Casey, come out on the dance floor. Everyone make way, make way. Okay, now the prom king and queen will have the dance floor to themselves. Hi. <laughs> Thank you. Um, to have a private dance with their dates. No. Okay, okay. okay Gerald. We don't well, need to do that, honestly. What did we expect? Okay, girls, the final touch. Hi, JJ. Where's your Urban Cowboy perfume? What? Uh, I don't have one. <gasps> All the cool kids have Urban Cowboy perfume. Yeah, because it smells good and it's vegan. Think of the horses, JJ. What do you use for perfume? Sometimes I rub the inside of a lemon on me. It kind of stings. Well, you can't sit with us until you smell like blossoms, okay? Wait, but how do I get one? We bought it on the TikTok shop. How do you buy something on the TikTok shop? Figure it out. Call us when you get one. <laughs> that was weird. What? <laughs> what the heck is going on? What the fork? Okay. All right, class. Maybe I was just hallucinating. Please take out your urban cowboy perfume. What? JJ, I said take out your urban cowboy perfume. What the heck is going on? <laughs> what the heck? Mom, Dad, something really weird is going on. All the cool kids have urban cowboy. All the cool kids have urban cowboy. Now my friends will let me sit with them again because I smell good. If you want to get one just like me, you can get one by clicking this button right here. Try it. Click it. See what happens. Okay, I need help deciding who I'm going to prom with. This is very important. How many people have asked you? Three? Damn. I really value all of your opinions. Except JJ, she's still learning. Fair enough. I'm just happy to be here. Okay, I've made a very important PowerPoint to go over the pros and cons of each candidate. Please pay attention. This is so extra. Do we get popcorn? Okay, first candidate. That wasn't a rhetorical question. Rose. She kind of looks like me. No, she doesn't. She's way prettier than you. 17. Ben. She lay. Pros. Super pretty. She is pretty. Captain of the cheerleading team. Super wealthy family. JJ, are you paying attention? Sorry. 
has leadership qualities. Probably good in bed. That's fair. How do you know that? Next. Okay, the cons. Crystal lesbian. What's a crystal lesbian? Small boobs. I have small boobs. There's nothing wrong with small boobs. Shoes with mouth open and hooked up with Emma Whitlock. Hey, I like Emma. I mean, everyone's hooked up with Emma Whitlock. Oh shit, it's three o'clock. Are you ready to go trick-or-treating? It's not even dark yet. It's too dangerous to go in the dark. I'm not five. All my friends are going at night. No, you're not going with your friends. We are taking you. Mom, that's so lame. You can go with us. Or you cannot go at all. People already make fun of me enough. I don't need to give them another reason. There's so many reasons. What's one more? Fine. I need a bag to collect my candy in. No, we're not getting candy this year. What? There could be drugs in it. Why can't you ever just let me have fun? You can have fun without doing drugs. I don't want to do drugs. I just want to go trick or sweeting. Why am I even going out there if I can't even collect the candy? So you can still participate in the holiday and not miss out. Just safely. We're not awful parents. So we're just gonna walk up and down the street? Yes, so you can show off your costume. This is an old bedsheet and a $5 witch hat that you bought from Costco. Don't be ungrateful. Can I at least carry a bag so I don't look like a total loser? Fine. Here. This is a Target bag. You really hate me, don't you? 